Miss Lisa D. Hart here, Three Minutes with the Main Guide. We're back with the camper. And today I'm going to 303 this camper, protect it from the UV, bring out the nice shine and depth in it back um, once again. So I'm using this 303 aerospace protectant, vinyl, rubber, plastic, fiberglass, and leather, it says. Uh, also does really great on canoes. So it's a pretty simple procedure. Just going to spray it on nice and thick. And then I'm going to wipe it in. And if you're old enough to remember wax in a car, it doesn't turn white like that used to do, but you will be able to see it dry to like an opaque and then just like in the old days when you'd wax a car, you got to buff that out. So I'm going to do that and I'll get back to you. Okay, so the 303 is on there. It's dry. Um, one canoe I, is about a third of this bottle. I think you could get three out of it. I like to put a lot on. Um, you can see, I'm going to take the camera here. You can, I think you can kind of see... See how it's nice and depth and shinier, but kind of an opaque. Um, this is what we're going to buff out with a, a dry cloth because the other one's full of 303. So we're just going to go just like the old time wax in a car. You, we're just going to buff this out. Um, I don't use gloves when I do it. It doesn't, I do wash my hands after I've soaked the cloth and gone through it. It doesn't seem to bother my hands though, which is saying something for me because when it comes to chemicals, I am the canary in the mine. So, um, but I've never used gloves doing it. So now I'm just going to buff it out and, um, and I'm going to show you how, um, how shiny it's going to be. So here it is done. You can see it's got nice color to it now, nice depth. And um, every year you do it, because uh, I know I got two canoes now, a bunch of canoes I've been doing it two years in a row. The paint gets darker, it looks newer and newer. Um, I flipped it over so that I could get the deck plates and the gunnels um, 303'd. Uh, stay tuned next week. We're going to pad the portage yoke get the uh get the seat in and get the lines on it like i like it you take care of it and it'll take care of you i'm lisa dehart and you've just spent three minutes with the main guide mm -hmm.